Hey guys, welcome back to my playthrough of God of War Ragnarok. And as you can see, we are playing once again as Atreus. And if you look in the background, we are indeed in Asgard. There's the Lake of the Nine down there. It's quite funny when we were in Midgard, the Lake of the Nine just took up the entire map. I mean, it was the game. And now that we're here in Asgard, it just seems so small. Like, I mean, it looks big down there for sure, but, you know, kind of what I mean is it's, it seems compared to the rest of the continent, you know, Asgard seems so big and you can just really tell how just huge this world is. Really, they're all big, but this one really puts it into perspectives. Oh, look at those waterfalls down there. That looks so amazing. Um, I think that's where we came in at, actually, and then we went around that rock, I think, and we traveled through that area there. Uh, there is the Bifrost Bridge, I believe, unless they call it something else in this game. It's quite a beautiful sight. And at the very end of the last episode, we ran into no other than Heimdall. And, uh, he looks wicked. He's got some wicked eyes. A very, very interesting little interaction there. We're going to see how this goes now. Let's do it. Now feel free to drink in the splendor of Asgard. This is a rare sight for outsiders. Especially giants. I think I will. Okay. Yes. Why not steal anything that is not nailed down? That is sure to impress your hosts. So this is the other side of the wall. It looks like we have a town down there. Now join me on the platform, won't you? The Allfather doesn't like to be kept waiting. I'll be there in a second, Heimdall. Looks like we're going to be heading down there. Um... To be honest, this is actually isn't that impressive. Um... I mean, it just looks like a village. I was expecting, you know, golden towers or something like that. I mean, the wall around is very impressive, but... I don't know, I was kind of expecting, I don't know, something that you kind of saw in the Thor movie, uh, or Thor Ragnarok, you know, what we saw in, uh, the Marvel movie. You know, like, Golden Streets or something like that. They do have been doing, uh, very different takes on these characters, though, so. Uh, where does the Bifrost Bridge start, I wonder? Oh, done drinking it in already. Yes. Cornerstone of civilization in the Nine Realms, not really your cup of tea. I see. Oh, uh, no. <sighs> Just ask your questions already. How'd you know I had questions? It is my job. Next question. What is your job? I protect the realm I love from trouble. And you think I'm trouble? You just met me. And I can already see you are eager to prove yourself. Way too eager. Probably due to an overshadowing father figure you can never live up to. Good guess. I would also guess that you are... disrespectful. Entitled and... impulsive. You don't know me at all. I help people. Oh! You are here to help people. Hmm. No. No. You are here to help yourself. To manipulate and lie to whoever you have to to get what you want. I know you're young. Your voice probably dropped while you were climbing the wall, but <laughs> what a twisted little soul you have. <laughs> you are chaos in a spiffy archer suit. I watch your mouth move and I see cities burning. Nothing good is going to come from you being in Asgard. That said, if you are here to aid the Allfather and have no treacherous intent, I guess that makes us allies. Very interesting uh, little dialogue there. Heimdall, the bearer of Yalahorn. Mimir said he was uh, dangerous, a true believer of Odin. He didn't mention what a complete jerk he is or that he seems able to read people somehow. The less time I saw... Uh, the less time I spend around this guy, the better. 
the way that he described Atreus is almost dead on, um, except for the last part, how he kind of sees chaos in him and deception. The thing is, is what we know about Loki and the lore, you know. That, cool you know. Who loves me the most? Who loves me the most? Wow, that's almost as impressive as Balder taming a dragon. Balder had the luxury of not caring how badly he got burned. I outthink them. Dominate them fair and square. Out. And we got uh, Asgardians, man, and... You're wearing a mask, too. Is everyone here wearing a mask? Or armor? These guys aren't. Just kind of like a rural village. So this is Asgard? It's interesting. Whoa. Are these all Aesir gods? What? You think all Aesir are gods? But Skilder told me that only. Oh, well, if Skilder told you, clearly whoever that is must be the authority on Aesir gods, not the Aesir god you are currently talking to. You literally know nothing of our culture, do you? I know lots of things. I know a giant built that wall. A giant built the wall that keeps out the giants. Primther, son of Thamur. I know the whole story. Really? I truly cannot wait for you to regale me with the revisionist tales of Asgard's architectural history. Is that Odin's palace? Palace? Do you think the Allfather needs to puff himself up like some mortal chieftain? I guess not. That is the Great Lodge, which the Allfather built with his own hands. I'm sorry if that is a letdown for you. Real power, you see, does not need to flaunt. It emerges when the time is right. Don't you agree? Ha! Hey! Whoa! Ah! Hey, Helmets! I brought you a practice gun. I thought we were going to own it. You see, the thing is, you do. So I am not letting you anywhere near the old. Who are That's right. Show me all of your stupid little tricks. Oh, very nice. With that, so ever fought. I am sure about that. Yes, I am feeling very sure, matter of fact. This guy's a god, man. Oh god! <laughs> you yeah. were counting on that to protect you? Guess those arms have got oh, okay. a little bit. He's fast. Oh. oh no! Arrow! How fearsome! You're not... Ha. That is your big special move. God, he's Hilarious. fast. I can't land a hit on him. Cowboy. Oh, oh. oh, that one felt special. 
Hope that was not the last trick you have. Is that it? Is this all you have to show me, Jotun? Uh, oh, maybe. He's trying to grab me. Sure. Completely ineffective, so keep doing it. Whoa. Whoa. How is yeah, I'm no match for this guy. I do have to say, Loki, I am profoundly unimpressed. You should probably stay down. Great. <laughs> Knock it off. Like it or not. All father's guest. But I thought I smelled something. Take one more step, you're not gonna like how this ends. Really? And how do you intend to stop me? Look into my eyes. You tell me. You are a sick man. Loki! You made it! I am so honored. I, I see you've met Heimdall. He reads minds for me. The boy is false, our father. This young man, who is my guest, is covered in mud. Care to explain? He means to betray you. <gasps> is that true, Loki? You a little trickster? Uh, I'm just messing around. Of course he means to betray me, huh? Heimdall, why else would he come? I've given him no reason to trust me. Not yet. But he's got some very big questions. And I have so many answers to give. What are you up to? Dismissed. Go. Gladly. And you, clean yourself up. Oh, oh, my. See, uh, Heimdall, will you just relax? Were you intending on killing me first thing? See? What, that's not good enough for you? Get out of here. <laughs> He's a lot, I know. Very perceptive, but sometimes he just forgets to think. You know? Hey, I got some places to be. So how'd your father take the news that you decided to accept my invitation? I don't think we should talk about my father. Not well, huh? <laughs> Can't blame him. Between my ex-wife and my disgruntled former employee, he's not exactly getting an unbiased view. But you, you're curious, open-minded. That's important. Oh my god, those are Valkyries. Greased, meast, carry on, pretend I'm not here. If I'm being honest with you, Loki, you're lucky my offer still stands after you went and sprung tear. But I suppose spending time with him is punishment enough, isn't it? <laughs> you would have been dead. <laughs> At least now. Mimir never lost his sense of humor. But look, it, that's all behind us now. I like to keep looking forward. Hey, hey, hey! I want them trained, not decapitated. Just keep it below the neck, all right? Is that really what you do when I'm not here? Also, Queen Gana. The Ainhuyar are ready for your blessings. Oh, that's why I'm here, isn't it? <sighs> Yes, there's a new Valkyrie queen. Great soldiers, these Ain Harry are, but they tend to come out of Valhalla a little foggy. I do what I can for them, help them remember who they were in life. That's important, don't you think? A sense of identity gives things meanings. Moon Finafen, Rothgar. Moon Finafen, Warm. Moon Finafen. Okay. 
Okay, next up. Um. <clears throat> so. Wow. Uh, there's a lot of interesting stuff going on here. Uh, let's just. Loki, we gotta keep moving. Okay. All Sorry. Right. All right. Got distracted. Let's just go. Let's just keep following him. Ah, the books. Good. Those are for him. I understand you're an avid reader. These are just a few things from my personal collection. Uh, thanks. Jurgen, those better not be mushrooms, I smell. Listen, I appreciate your offer, but I'm really not sure what you're expecting from me. Right now, you're just visiting, Loki. One step at a time. Steady there, Carl. But with all respect, you need to know... I came to study, not to serve. Another servant is the last thing I need. I need someone with drive, with curiosity. Someone will take initiative. That looks good. Is that braised? But why me? Is it because I'm half giant? Big deal. So is Thor. Erlen, try to stay awake for me. Okay, but... Look, don't overthink it. I have a project I think you'll be interested in. A major learning opportunity. Or both of us. What about my family? My friends? I need to know nobody's gonna get hurt. Why would I hurt anybody? A truce is all I've been asking for from the start, if you recall. Look, you're here now. Stop worrying. It's all gonna be fine. Almost to your room. My room? Yep, just over here. Feel free to come and go. Take what you need, poke around as you please. You're not my prisoner. And more importantly, I'm not your father. All father, there's a situation that needs your attention. Sif, you missed welcoming our new house guest. Say hello to Loki. This is him? Here. In our home. How nice. My diplomat. Everything all right in New Midgard? The refugees are fine. The situation is with the dwarves. You know who is back. Yeah, it's always something. Put those books down. We got another stop to make. Uh, sure. I don't believe this. We were just, I was just, you know, brought up Lady Sif. In the last episode, I was like, man, wouldn't it be interesting if they in introduced more of these characters? And man, sure enough, they're doing it. I'm like a giddy schoolgirl right now. I can't believe this. This is so awesome, man. Meeting Sif was really uncomfortable. She was so icy towards me, I started to worry she knew what I did to Modi. Oh, is this Thor's wife? But I know nobody saw that. It's bad enough that she blames father, and now I'm in her home. If I know what's good for me, and I think I do... I'll just stay out of her way. Hey. Yeah. All right. I'm here. Where is he? He? Oh, he, uh, just over there. All father. Sir. We are back in need of a Lear. Oh my gosh. Uh. Chief, it's been too long. What's the issue now? No issue at all if you're trying to build volatile death traps. I approve these designs personally, and not all that recently, I might add. Did you just wake up with the urge to be a pain in my ass? Yeah. Who's the cut? You draining puck pockets? You know what, Durlin? You reek of cheap mead, and that is by far your most endearing characteristic. Now listen up. It's me, your entire economy, speaking. I want you to know that I have confidence in you. Confidence you can deliver me these machines as promised, on time, on budget, and of course, safely. The dwarves have never let me down, and they're not about to start now. Right? Good. So Derlin's pretending that he hasn't seen us before. He's smart. Lucky, trying to make an exit here. 
smart to not say anything. Man, Odin is just traveling across realms like it's nothing. You're a threat. Okay, son. I'm gonna let you catch your breath. When you're ready to get to work and start getting those answers, meet me in my study down the hall. Oh, and help yourself to a change of clothes. Man, this is intense. After all the terrible things I've heard about Odin, I never expected him to be so respectful of me. Back at the cabin when he invited me to Asgard, and since arriving here, he seems genuinely interested to know who I am and what I think. I know I can't trust him too far, but it's nice to be listened to. I feel safer around him than I thought I would. Let's see what answers he has for me. Man, it's just like... So there's a couple things that I'm thinking. I mean, one, this could all be a trick, you know, which is the most likely scenario. We have learned from the first game and the events so far in this game that Odin has been horrible. But in truth, we have only seen that one perspective. You know, we've seen Tyr's perspective, Freya, and of course we've heard most of the lore from Mimir. Now, you know, it's not like I have any reason to doubt them. They're the good guys and stuff. But I don't know. It's like at the same time... Uh, you know, like I said, it's very likely all this is a trick to just earn my trust. And deep down, Odin really is like bad news. But at the same time, you know, the most interesting characters aren't either bad nor good. They're kind of a mixture of both. So even though Odin has done some bad things, some very bad things, maybe he's also done some good things. And there might be some serious conflict here. Because Atreus here... Is kind of torn between the middle now. I mean, he is Loki. And Loki is, you know... I mean, he might have a future here in Asgard. As many of us know, at least what we've seen the version of Loki in, like, you know... Uh, uh, different iterations. But Atreus is Kratos' son, also. And, um... This is interesting. This is all very, very interesting. Okay, so do I have a new set of armor? Armor crafted by the smiths of Asgard and fitted perfectly for Loki. Guess I could try this on. It has less mud on it anyway. Your uniform. Bow abilities and runic summons have reduced cooldowns. A seer bow. Nice! And we have runic recharge. Killing an enemy, an enemy with a runic arrow immediately restores one in its place. Wait, killing an enemy with a runic arrow immediately restores one in its place. Or not one. I'm not sure. I? What is it? It's, uh, it's like a symbol? Like the... I don't know. Upgrades increase the number of arrows restored. Whoa, I can use this. Charge. Let's check it out. Hmm. Nicely equipped. What needs work? Bow. We have the Asir bow. We can craft it. Let's equip it. Um, can't really tell exactly what it looks like from this angle. We can upgrade it again, though. Yildir timber. Um, talon bow. Yeah, why don't we upgrade it again? Bow abilities and runic summons have greatly reduced. Sure. And now the special items, which is the accessories. Reckless Empowerment. All damage dealt is increased while runic arrows are fully depleted. Okay. Didn't we have another one? Okay. I can't equip anything from this uh, area here. Okay. 
and resources. I have a superior resurrection stone already on me. So we're good there. Okay. Let's try and equip this stuff if I can. Let's see, we do have the Asir bow. Oh, it's kind of green. Green like Loki's color. Ooh, look at that. It's not unlike the armor Brock made, but uh, this one has a green tint to it. Yeah, let's wear this one. Since we're here and all. And we want a uh, runic recharge. Killing an enemy. Why don't we go ahead and try this one out? Uh, we'll switch. I guess this one. And then we have runic potency. Sure. We'll switch out that one. I think those are the two, right? Oh, we did upgrade this one. Reckless Empowerment. Um, sure. Why not? Okay. How about our skills? Do we have more that we can upgrade? We do. We have quite a bit, in fact. Hex Potency. Hex Explosions caused by Atreus Sigil Arrows have an increased area of effect. Okay. Mm, what's this? Okay, what's this? Ooh. Uh, and then we have this one. Sure. And then we'll do this one. All right. We are good. Check this out. Looking pretty good. Okay. So this is my room. I've got my own room. Dang. I gotta tell you, this is so interesting. I'm just taken for a loop. I have no idea what to expect in this. Odin? I mean, even this whole place... Whoa! Loki, right? Gotta say, the irony of this isn't lost on me. This was his room, you know? His? My brother's. Your brother? Modi? Ah, oh, your brother. Really? I had no idea. Uh huh. And now it's yours. Enjoy. Fruit throws, Doctor. Relax. You've got some pretty small shoes to fill. We're better off without him, Loki. Trust me. Walk with me. Uh, don't forget your sword. <clears throat> uh, someone will clean that up. <clears throat> so if you remember, Modi is the one that we killed so, by hand. So, uh... What kind of sword is that? It's new. One of a kind. My father gave it to me for Valkyrie training. You're in Valkyrie training? Got time to talk about it? I was just heading to the Great Hall. But if you need to go to work, grandfather's study is just down those stairs. Join the Allfather in his study when ready. No, no, we can hang out for a little bit. Let's look around. It's up here. Oh, okay. So how do you become a Valkyrie? First, I train till I'm the best I can be. Then I wait till grandfather notices. And then I hope he and my dad can convince mom it's okay. You know, my father and I, we 
encountered a whole bunch of Valkyries. What? Where? Promise to tell me everything. I promise. Mother, did you meet Loki? Oh. Now he's got you involved with this? Involved with what? I'm being friendly. Isn't that diplomacy? You understand who this is, right? What his father did? Why does he want him here? Mom! Come on, you're embarrassing me. We'll talk about this later. I have to say, they've nailed the Viking aesthetic, though, haven't they? I don't know. This... I mean, it's... It's... Like, are these just mindless zombies, though? But these aren't. No, there isn't. The honey spoiled. Honey doesn't spoil. Stop being weird. I am not being weird. You're being weird. Oh, seriously. Sif makes eye contact with people all the time, you know. Comes with having eyes. But what did it mean? Am I in trouble? You will be. If you keep discussing this in her earshot, you absolute idiot. I, I, I must have done something wrong. I, I'll get her again. Do not. I will. Maybe I'll get her some meat. Just shut up and drink. But something's different with the, the meat. No, there isn't. Like the honey spoiled. Now they're starting over. Doesn't spoil. Stop being weird. In conversation. Sorry about her. Moms, right? So, did you want to look around some more, or do you really need to get to work? Comes with having eyes. I want to look around. I'm so tired. You will be if you keep discussing this in Yeah. Absolutely. Days get colder. The nights get longer. Your body doesn't know when to work or when to sleep anymore. I will. Maybe I'll get her. Not sure how long we're meant to handle this. Hey, Shut up and drink. long as we need to. That's what the Aesir would say. The Aesir are gods. No, there isn't. I don't think the gods have trouble falling asleep. Uh, Honey doesn't spoil. Some Stop of them might. Weird. Just, um... I am not being weird. You're being weird. <laughs> well, oh, not Aesir. Sif makes Still, you feel time, it, you know. don't you? Comes with having in the eyes. air. Yeah, the anxiety. Am I in trouble? Even from the Allfather's you ranks. If you keep discussing this in her earshot, you you're not wrong. idiot. It'd be frightening I if something wrong. I'll get her if I weren't so damn Do tired. Not. <sighs> Maybe. Yeah. Well, how are you feeling now? Just shut up and drink. <sighs> I'm so <Something's> tired. <laughs> yeah. No, there isn't. Days get colder. Now they're starting the nights over. get longer. So it looks like we've got some NPCs on, uh... Please do not involve me in your pathetic attempts to impress one another. Huh? Come on. You haven't had enough Heimdall in your day? Let's go. He really does not like us. The Aesir are gods. I don't think the gods have trouble following What a roundabout way to commit suicide that would be. Poison Thor. Why not try to destroy a mountain using a soup spoon? That's what I told Forsetti. Except more politely, I'd assume. Except considerably more politely, yes. <sighs> Didn't do much to dissuade him, though. He seems, well, I'd say paranoid. But more than usual. Yeah, I can't blame him, I suppose. Anything else to report? Saw Forsetti the other day. <laughs> How tragic for you. What was he doing? Investigating the kitchen. For what? He'd somehow gotten it into his head that someone was trying to poison Thor. <coughs> what a roundabout way to commit suicide. Now they're starting the conversation over. So interesting. I am not being weird. You're being they're not gonna say anything. Um yeah, some interesting stuff going on here. Looks like they're all feeling the effects of Fimble Winter. This chick looks like that chick from Horizon Zero Dawn. Um, what's her name? One of those unpronounceable Norse names? Uh, I think she's Thor's daughter, though, isn't she? Heimdall hates our guts. So, which direction do we go now? Whatever Grandfather is having you do, remember, 
This is your chance to prove yourself. That's all that some of us want. Oh, yeah. I'll try to do some good. Now, you know, a lot of this is their, like, culture. It, you know, has to do with, what, like, honor and stuff? I don't know. So is there nothing else to do? Just, you know. What about through here? This is my room. No. That's my room. Used to be Magni's. Guess I'm moving up. So Magni was the bigger one. Check this out. Dang. So this was Magni's room. That one over there is mine. That was Modi's. You don't want to bother Forsetti. He's all work. I don't know who Forsetti is. That's where Balder stayed. When he stayed anywhere. Damn. That's where mom and dad sleep. Ever hear a thunder god snore? Cause you're gonna. That's Thor's room. Makes sense. And then Odin's room is down the hall. Okay. I think we've got the layabout. Thanks. Uh, whatever your name was. Catch you later. Rude. Oh. I understand. Yes. Do you see me nodding and saying, yes, I understand? I... I... Uh-huh. Yes. Yes, all right. Mm-hmm. You see, this is you not letting me talk. No, Hugan, I, I don't need my ears clean. I need you to stop croaking and 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 accept the answer you know I'm about to give. I was just looking at this. I don't think. I've had that since... Who can remember? You, you have a name? Ingrid. Really? Sure, why not? Take it, if you like it that much. For real? Consider it a perk of the job. Thank you. I mean, really. And they say I'm the bad guy. Come on, let's walk. Odin. Ingrid. <clears throat> I found a magic sword in Odin's study. It says her name is Ingrid and that I can carry her while I'm here. She seems really happy to be getting out and seeing some action. Do swords get bored? I wonder where she came from. It looked like Atreus, uh, like I stilled some, um, some notes here on his table. Uh, something tells me. Walk with me, please. Something tells me Odin saw it anyway, though. I think he knows a lot more than we realize. Everyone's got me all wrong. You think war drives me or power, wealth? Nah, never have. You know what drives me? What I really want? I want answers. Same as you. See, mortals have it easy. When they push up against life's big questions, they can look to us. They give them meaning, divine comfort. <laughs> We both know that's a sham. But when we have questions, why are we here to give meaning to mortals while living without it ourselves? No. We're more than that. And I found something that proves it. What is it? It's what drives me. You feel it, don't you? Feels like Knowledge. Truth. All truth. All the answers. We could find out why we're here, learn how to change our fates, stop Ragnarok for good, maybe. Save the people we love. How? 
I was a young god when I found it. Spent lifetimes studying it, following every clue down every dead end, looking for and finally unearthing this. You see that? It shares the same mystical energy. It opened a crack. Can we just look inside? I wouldn't recommend that. What's the broken mask for? Recognize any writing on it? These aren't from the Nine Realms. Small bear. Obsidione Spitha. From smoldered earth and obsidian spark and a field of battles never fought. Are you certain? Because if that's the clue, I know what it means. And what's that? Keep working with me and find out. You don't have to kill anyone. You don't have to betray your father or yourself. Come on, I know you felt what I felt. The answers are in there. Let's get them. I mean, you translated this language like it was nothing. If I do help you, what's next? Thor, get down here. All oh, father. Don't do that. What's next is chasing this down. Take this and this stealthy side of beef and see where it takes you. I don't promise anything. Nonsense. Happy hunting. And you, go easy on him, you hear me? I don't believe it. I don't believe it. We're teaming up with Thor. Moose Bahan? The rest of the mask is here? It's where all father dropped us. What do you think? Just take that and do your damn job. I do not believe this. This is insane. So, where are we going? What the fuck am I supposed to know? All father thinks that you know what you're doing, so do it. Press that to equip the mask. Mask guidance. The mask is attuned to Atreus's goal and will radiate light when he is following the correct path. Okay. Weird. Well, it seems like we go through this rock. I was gonna get that. <laughs> With those arms? Oh my god, this is amazing! <laughs> We're back in Muspelheim. Check this out! Oh my gosh, and Thor is with us. We're traveling with Thor, man. I don't believe it. Ah, oh, just this is. <laughs> We're just like, oh man, my jaw is just dropped, man. I just look at this place. Oh, it looks way better than in the first game, doesn't it? So we are in Muspelheim. There is no map to follow at all right now. Nothing is showing up. Are we gonna run into Surtur at some point? That would be wicked. I cannot believe how this game, the twists and turns in it. This is just insane. I think the dialogue between us is gonna be very interesting here. Burning cliffs. Let's see what Loki and that shiny toothpick is. Uh, how do I use my sword? <gasps> Oh, my sword is already fighting. That's interesting. It's just going off and fighting by itself. It may be help. Oh, Adrian. Nice move. Out of the hole, Bob. Oh, 
watching us right now. So if I do this, I can command the sword. Just like I, I could command my own, you know, like another partner. Where are we supposed to head now? I'll check. So the sword just swings around and floats. Okay. Now check the mask. Hold that thought, big boy. All right. Ooh, boy. I'm just taking it all in. Just taking it all in. Do this way. Up there. It looks like there might be a ledge we could reach. If we too slow. Hey! Oh boy. You can't just grab people like that. No, what else are they gonna do? Throw you? Oh my gosh, Thor is gonna fight with us. Today's now. young. I mean, look at him go. We could probably just stand back and let Thor do everything. There's things up there hitting us with fire. Use your ball already. Okay. Oh, up there? Where? You take this one, kid. Okay. Do her up! You know, I took my blood payment from your father for what happened to my sons. But I haven't taken it from you. Yet. What do you mean? Later. Don't want to keep the all-father waiting. Speaking of which, mass. Right. Hey, if I'm not mistaken, isn't this the area where we were in the first game? Hold that thought. Uh, in the first game, we were like around Surtur's sword. I, I think it would be cool if we could explore this realm too. I mean, is this going to be another realm we can explore? So far, we've been able to venture and explore all kinds of stuff. Not that way, huh? So where then? Probably through here? Looks like something Thor could destroy. Hey, big boy. We need to head through those rocks. Hey, can you... Move your fat ass. Let's go. Yeah, that. Just imagine what it can do to bone. Yeah. I'm gonna go back this way for a second. You don't mind waiting, do you? Thought you said it was this way. It is! I just wanted to see what's over here. Well, this isn't the right way. This is locked. Oh, wow. Is that some kind of anvil? That? That thing right there. How can you tell? Like we might eventually be able to get over there. I can't do anything with this right now. This thing, it's like on fire. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, there's a chest here. Hmm. Axova. Sorry to keep you if waiting, it ain't Thor. There, let's keep moving. Come on. That looks like a nasty cut. Kratos gave you, my dad. Like he stabbed you good. 
Thor might be a big You want to talk about blood payment? What about the giants you killed? They were my family. Thalmor, Ronan, they were your people too. The giants were blight on the Nine Realms and I reveled in every single one of their deaths. Let's just change the subject. Y you know, uh, the last time Father and I were here, we beat every one of Surtur's trials. Think you could... Don't play me. So, we can't do anything with this. That looks like something we'll have to do when we come back here with Kratos. However, we get past this thing. Thor is a, uh... I mean, he's a monster, man. He's a bad dude. Okay, what are you gonna do here, big boy? Oh, that. I'm almost there. Listen, Modi had some problems, but he was my son. And the only reason you aren't mush right now is because of that broken piece of wood. Look, clearly neither of us can do this mission alone. And I want to impress the Allfather just as much as you do. You don't have to like me, but we're gonna have to trust each other. Just a little bit. Trust. Special ability. I was wondering what it would be. Something tells me we're not gonna have an issue here with Thor. Good form overall, but not aggressive enough in my opinion. I'm more than welcome to step it up. This is me trusting you. Big boy. Okay, so where's the mask saying to go? Well, let me see. Way it seems. Oh, this way. Hey, kid, where's the mask pointing us? Like out this way. Hold that thought. I'm gonna make okay, sure. Okay, so where's the mask saying to go? Hold that thought. Just gonna make sure I gather the loot. Then out here. Somehow, I don't think the mask is telling us to go here. I do hear one of Odin's ravens. I wonder what's going to happen if I destroy it with Thor here. This can't be the way. I'm just looking. All fathers waiting. Where's the mask safe to go? Another one of these. So... Where did I hear that bird at? Did I hear it in here? It looks like it's somewhere over here. That mask got directions for us? It looks like... Maybe the bird is somewhere up there? I think I've explored 
Alright, so it's gonna be this way. I think. Maybe out here. Somehow. Somewhere. The mask is, uh, pulling this way. We'll have to find some way down. Sure thing. I wasn't playing you, by the way. The trials are fun. Don't you ever have fun? You're so different from your daughter. She said... Hey, come look at this. Thor, what the... Sutter Shrine. You didn't die over there, did you? No, nope, I'm still alive. Sutter Shrine. Okay. No, but I was thinking. Well, that's your problem. <sighs> Trials are just packed that clip. I do something new to do it. First, we deal with them. Come on, Thor. Just check them out. What have you got to lose? Time. Out of my hope up. That's right. Just try it. You getting tired? Not slightly. <laughs> God. Well, well, well. Looks like we finally are facing a troll. Worry. Not in the slightest. I haven't fought one of these in this game yet. There's two of them now. Because of course there is. Another ogre? Oh, I hate to say it, but me and Thor make a pretty damn good team. waited hundreds of winters. He can wait a little more. It's fun. Fine. Stay right here. Yes, sir. That should keep him busy for a while. Hopefully. Come on. Give me a challenge. So he's doing the trials that me and... Uh, now to get to that shrine. Kratos did. So he's going after it up there. So that was a little tactic, tactic that Atreus was doing. Thor's still busy. I should get to that shrine. Yes, yes, we will. Right after we uh, collect everything. Sure, he'll remain busy. Falcon's Dive. Runic Summon. Ooh, check that out. Yeah, let's try this one for a while. You can upgrade it too. Excelente. The shrine's there. 
we should be able to climb down. Or, well, you'll fly, I assume. <laughs> Alright. Let's do it. We don't want to give away any secrets. Hey, Ingrid. Do you trust the ace here? I mean, I know I can't trust them. I just need them to trust me. But that's only gonna happen if they think I trust them. Yeah. My father and I visited this place the last time we were in Muspahan. Feels like forever ago. Ah, that's why this chest has been already opened and broken. So this was the place where we got to the trials the last time. So this is the entrance. I do remember this from the first game. Yes, indeed. Here's the shrine. Oh, oh. Why did you leave me? Oh, because we have enemies. Ow. Oh, God. Go destroy this uh, can't thing. you guys go fight Thor or something? Okay. Please get away from me. Ooh, this place is hot. You can hear Thor battling it out all the way over there. Okay. I only got a little ways in the trials in the first game. I didn't actually complete them. A lot of people did though. Here we go. Loki. Oh! <laughs> <Huh. Ingrid> <laughs> You know, for someone who was trained as a warrior, you are tragically easy to startle. I, I... I didn't. What are you doing here? A girl can't visit a shrine of her own volition? You're here for Sorter's marble. Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> You're out looking for more giant marbles? You know what this looks like, right? Like the life story of one of our people? And also maybe a storage closet. No. This looks an awful lot like Defying Destiny. <laughs> the question is, what are you doing here? Rewriting my story. Odin gave that to you? It's not. Well, he did, but it's not. I'm not working with him. I would never tell him anything about Ironwood if that's what you're worried about. And I'm definitely not serving him. It's prophecy's words, not mine. I've got a marble to find. You're welcome to help if you want. Fun. But are you sure you're up for breaking the rules like this? There aren't any prophecies of you collecting any marbles. Our endings haven't been written, right? Come on. Shame. <laughs> oh, hello there. A sentient sword. Huh. Another marble. Surters. No soul in it, though. So he's still out there somewhere. A while back, you talked about how the giants left. You ever think about them? All the time. They're far from here. Far from Odin and Thor. But I wonder what lands they've gone to, what seas they've crossed. Why? I want to find them. I'm going to save my father, and then I'll find them. It's starting. Who is that? Not Surtur, that's for sure. Look at all that frost. Sinmara. Hmm. Don't think I've heard of her before. And here comes Surtur. Wow. This must have been some fight. Yeah, until it wasn't. It just stopped? 
Oh, no, no, no. Look, it's because they fought together. Looks like they even became friends. Uh, good friends. Huh. Are they? Yeah. I think they are. Oh, well, that's... Good for them. But it looks like they're... Um... Love caused them to combine into some kind of huge creature. Ragnarok. And then... Ragnarok destroys Asgard. Right. I saw that in Groa's Shrine. Well, that was... something. Oh, hey, remember the snake we put that soul in? Can't really forget that. I saw it. It's getting... bigger. Like, faster than normal bigger. Yeah, I had a feeling that would happen. Huh. I'm gonna hang back here. Don't want your, uh, friend to see a giant he missed. Of course. Just be careful. Please. You too, Loki. Is that snake Jormungandr? I think according to the lore, uh, Loki, like, somehow gives birth, you know, or, like, his wife or something, his offspring is Jormungandr. Um... So, I wonder if that snake grows into into the big snake in Midgard. But if so, does that mean that somehow Ironwood... How does that work? Oh my gosh, I don't know. Oh, this is going to be interesting. Hey, Ingrid. I think Thor died from... You thought you could defeat the God of Thunder? Oh. Okay. So, we need to head back up to uh, where we left off. We're going to go ahead and end this episode there, though. Uh, when we come back, we're going to go up there and I'm sure Thor will finally be finished fighting at that point. Uh, yeah, and uh, we'll see how this unfolds. In any case, thanks so much for watching, guys. Have a great freaking day.